Hello my loves and welcome to Family Wounds and Forgiveness. We are talking about what is forgiveness. My name is Kellyanne and I've been working through a lot of family wounds which I talked about in a previous video as well as um, I've been learning that setting the tone for forgiveness is one of the best ways to function in a healing space and that is also excuse me, in a previous video. <laughs> if you haven't watched those, make sure you go and watch those first. And just note that there is a course coming after this video series. So if you watch all of these videos and you feel like it's not enough, I wanna go deeper, I've got you covered with a lot of different learning styles covered. There's going to be things for auditory and visual and kinesthetic learners. So whatever you need, it's going to be in there. And I will make sure that I include the link to my page so that you can go and grab that as soon as you want it, as soon as you are ready to just take that deep dive. So what is forgiveness? Well, there is a whole subject on radical forgiveness and um, books on it and talks and I'm going to give you my dirty, short, quick version, which is that forgiveness is the choice to move on. We often uh, want to see change and want to change the nature of our relationships through forgiveness because in order for us to have good relationships, we need to feel at peace within them. And when there are family wounds present, we're, we're often walking on eggshells or feeling like I just can't have any peace with this person. So very often when we set the tone for forgiveness, what we have in mind is sharing the turmoil and the hurt with the people who have caused that hurt uh, in order for them to understand us and show that they understand us, so then we can uh, bestow upon them our forgiveness. It's like we need them to understand before forgiveness can be given. But I want to sort of wash that that away for you. I want to clear that out of your mind as you go through this and recognize that for forgiveness to radically heal you we need to do it radically. We need to, what radical means is to change the nature and the foundation of something. We need to change the nature of how we see forgiveness and we need to change the nature of how we see our relationships. And we cannot drag other people along the ride, along for the shadow journey or the spiritual journey ride, whatever journey you feel like you're on. We cannot uh, make other people see uh, what we have given them opportunities to understand and they didn't get or uh, went over their head or what they're not ready to address or hold themselves accountable for. Radical forgiveness is changing the nature of what you choose for yourself. And when it comes to family wounds, there is maybe an initial pain point or a pattern of, of pain that causes wounding over and over. Like if somebody said something mean and nasty to you and you, like a washing machine, just keep washing it over and over in your head and it never gets clean. <laughs> there is a, a kind of, of owie that, that happened at a certain point and suffering is the choice to continue telling that story of pain over and over and over again and defining yourself by the suffering that you feel. Forgiveness is the gift you give yourself of compassion, witnessing that suffering and having the desire to do something about it. And the only thing that you can really do about it is choose to move on. Now, I choose to move on, not just by sticking it in the corner and saying, get over it, but by holding it out in front of me and saying, nobody else can uh, prove to me that they are worth forgiving, but I can prove to myself that forgiveness is going to make me feel better. It's going to help me get over these resentments. It's going to help me release 
all of these, uh, all of this blame that's been blocking me from telling an, an empowering story, a self-protecting story. And I'm going to be talking more about this. So stay tuned, like this video, if it resonated and it helped you shift your mind about what forgiveness really is. And be sure to subscribe so that you can get the rest of these series as each video comes out. There are going to be new videos all the time, not just on this topic, but on a few other topics that I have in mind. And like I said, there is a course coming. So be on the lookout for that. And uh, once I finish this series, you will see a link to go and pick up that course. So if it's something that you want, um, it's going to come out. Uh, if you're watching this live and if you are keeping up with these live, you will you will see that um, I will have finished the course by the time that these this video series is done. Um, if you're watching after the video series is done, you can find the link in the description below. You can get to that forgiveness and healing and family wound healing as soon as possible, as soon as you feel ready. So if you feel ready now, you can go and check it out. Um, I love you so much. Thank you for joining me. And uh, you're deserving of all the love you desire. Hope you have a beautiful, wonderful rest of your day. Mwah. Mwah, mwah.